and welcome to another exciting day of grammar. As we've been working so much with lately, we've been doing a lot of sense fluency, with, and that's been doing a lot of our different lessons. So, let's use pronouns in our sense fluency to help eliminate repeating nouns, so you're not saying the same thing over. Like, the book you are reading is my book. That's kind of, eh. So, we would use a pronoun in here. The book you are reading is mine. So, we're going to rewrite the sentence using possessive pronouns. The article about dogs is my article. So, instead of article, which we're repeating, we would re rewrite that as... Article about dogs is mine. Unless, of course, you wrote it. It would be yours. Let's play at my house instead of your house. Once again, repeating the nouns makes for a poor sentence. It's not very fluent. It doesn't flow very well. So we'd want to change that to let's play at my house instead of yours. That's a U, not a V. Thank you. Uh, the next sentence. Is that toy your toy? So go ahead, pause the video, figure this one out, and see if we get the same answer. Go ahead, pause. And welcome back. That's two days in a row now that you didn't pause me. Nice going. Is that toy your toy? How would we rewrite that one? Samara. Good, I like that. We'll use yours exactly. Is that toy yours? Okay, and the last one. We can play with his dog or with her dog. What are you, how are you going to rewrite that to get rid of repeating about the dog? All right? So, copy that down on your sheet, fix it, and we'll take a look at it tomorrow. Thank you.